It's not just the teacher up there anymore. I mean, we have come such a long ways. They have the knowledge at their fingertips, especially in our district. And so it's, what can you do with that knowledge? And now that you have it, show us some great things. And they really do. Whenever I act out something, like a story from like a chapter or a part, it helps me understand the concept if I don't understand it. I know how to play video games, but I just wondered how people made them. Yeah, I designed my own game. When you get to the top of the roller coaster, you have more potential energy, and then as you go down, you gain kinetic energy. I really think being able to see something, you can actually start to form an idea. We could like actually see how it works, rather than just like writing it down on a piece of paper. I like working together because it's not like just my ideas, it's like both our brains together. So we were like working together and making more things and more ideas. You get more into it with not everybody agreeing instead of everybody agreeing on the same thing. You know, everybody's a little bit different. Everybody learns differently. In Fraser, what we've tried to do is really move towards a competency-based learning model where kids can demonstrate mastery and proficiency in specific competencies in content, skill, and concept that will allow them to move through their learning at their own pace. If I have a competency that I'm kind of struggling with, I was able to take that and, you know, on my own time learn it how I'm going to learn it and then master it, you know, at my own speed. I'm able to go at my own pace, but I'm also like learning that I, my pace can go a lot faster than what it used to go. I feel like I actually am learning the material, like I have, like I have to know it, and it's not just for getting the A, like it's I actually understanding what we're actually learning in school. <laughs> well, it's good to know that I can learn anything. I mean, before if I had gotten an F in a quadratic formula, I would have given it up, but now that I know I can retry, and that uh, that competency is um, necessary for me to pass that class. I know that it's something that I can do. Students know exactly what they need to know to master the class, the content, and the skills. When they leave the classroom, there are no gaps in their knowledge, and that raises confidence for students and empowers them. They're ready for the next challenge that awaits them. Um, leaving that class and they, we know that we prepared them with the skills needed to be successful at the next level. Are we creating a school system that will allow kids to move through individually while remaining connected socially, emotionally, through all the, the programs and services that we offer to their learning? And I think the role of the campus is really going to change as we go through that process. I think school and learning will happen in a lot of different places but our role of our schools will become much more of a community center and support system in that learning facilitation.